blocky? Does it look terrible? Or does it look crisp, clear, and smooth as a baby's behind? Let me know, chat. Test, test, can you hear me? Oh yes, also, can you see me? Beautiful, perfect. The human eye can only see 10 frames per second. It looks really, it looks like Minecraft. Looks good. I mean, it's okay, I guess. Okay, good. Very good, looks nice. Okay, we have to test the outside now. Come, Pinchy. Come, Eric. We have to go do a test outside now to see if it works. Oh yeah, look at all these masks. There's eight masks to collect in total. And then you have to place them on your own mask shrine as well. What about outside? We're going outside. Looks good inside? All right. Outside at night, the ultimate test. How does the moon look? Blocky? How do the trees look? Blocky? They look perfect to me. In fact, the whole thing is running like a goddamn dream right now. The whole thing is looking good. Big moon, beautiful. Is this the best performance we've had out of this game yet, would you say? No, it looks nice. It looks fine. It looks great. I'm moving around fast. Is it going all blocky and stuff? Can you guys see whatever that is down there? Looks like possibly it's like a... I can't even see it. Hey, bud. It looks like you a should tough. try out 900p 60fps at 6k bitrate. It's not bitty like 1080p is sometimes. Right, okay. And it's still really good quality. Well, Which encoder do you use? The encoder, I had to change it to that NVEC one because I was using the X, uh, whatever, 246 or whatever one, and for some reason the stream just wouldn't start, so I changed the, co the, the codec over to the other one, and that seems to have fixed it. Um, but I mean, if this works and it looks good, I'm, I'm fine keeping this. Does it look okay? No? Maybe? Possibly slow. Is the sound... The sound is out of sync. Your stream is lagging a lot. Okay. Are we having problems? It's A-OK. -okay. No one uses 900p. Okay. Hey, Jacob, thanks for 10 bucks, man. I really appreciate it. Bitrate needs improving. It's we're, we're at 6k right now, bitrate. We're at the highest that we can do on Twitch, so we can't go any higher than this. I don't know if there's any way that we can make it look like a bit nicer or something. Holy shit, I've never been down here before. Look at this, it's right on our doorstep. Look, we can come down here and see what's down here. Looks like there's like a great stag over in the distance. No lag, it's fine for you. Honestly, 60 FPS is always a bit much for you. Okay, 10 out of 10 here. No lag, no desync, no blocking. All right. Fuck, that's fantastic. That's great, guys. I'm happy. I'm happy that this is the case. Hang on a second. There's like some sort of like stone or something over here. We've never explored over here before, I don't think. Or have we? No, you know what? We haven't. Isn't there a dungeon around here somewhere? In like some sort of sunken tower or something? Is this guy not see me? It was an aspiring mage. A hunter! Oh my god, he had so much stuff on him too. Look, he's got some cooked beef on him. Oh, he's not gonna be needing that, so we're gonna take it. We're taking all of his pheasant breasts and his venison stuff too, and his wolf pelt, his leg of goat. That's right, hunter. Oh shit! Was this his horse? Wait, can we claim this horse to be our own horse now? This is like a unicorn. We just stole a horse. And look at... We look like such a pimp now, too, don't we? Fuck. Alright, let's steal this horse. Maybe we can... Since we're part of the Thieves' Guild, maybe this is the next thing that we need to do. Steal a bunch of horses as well. Alright, that was great. What a great foray out into the forest. To get us kicked off. To get us started off in a major way. Horseback archery. Oh my god. Can can you can't do horseback archery, can you? Oh shit, you can. I've been playing this game all this time and I didn't even realize that you could do a horseback archery. That's incredible. 
Okay, hold up. Watch out, Pinchy. Okay, I'm turning around. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's incredible. Holy shit. That's amazing. How amazing is that? Okay, now we actually have a horse for our stable. Hopefully this one doesn't run away. We've claimed it as our own. We stole a horse. Okay, let's park him in here. Where he can live forever. Apparently I can't get off the horse though. Inside the stable. Maybe a slight oversight from Bethesda. I don't think we can... Stay here. No, no, no. Where are you going now? Come on, you're mine now. You're my horse now. I don't think he's going to stay here easy. -y. All right. Shall we do this quest then? We meant to do it, right? Holy Frost Farm? Sure. We're doing it. Foose the horse. I don't want to do that to a horse. And anyway, I don't think it'll send him flying either. Hey, what's up? You look like a honest strong lord. Honest work. You want some help out here? Sure. Honest pay for honest work. A Nord in need is a Nord indeed. Let's do it. Master Cruel, he comes and works to field some. Honest pay for honest work. Be seeing you. Five bucks. Did it. Got it. 55 bucks, guys. 55 bucks for like two Sips. seconds of work. You get the devil himself in horse form from the Dark Brotherhood. Okay, Sinstress, thanks so much for letting me know. And thanks for the 10 bucks as well. I appreciate that. All right. It looks like there's some Nords over here. Some Stormcloaks, if you will. Having a fight with a horse. Now, I know this water is really cold. <laughs> but we still have to get over here and investigate. We're trying to keep the peace in the general area. Also, we're stuck under a sheet of ice. <laughs> stuck under one... Okay, no, there's no storm folks here. It looks like there's some sort of bandit highway man fighting... Like some sort of merchant or something? Guess it's all clear now. Here, peddler. Oh, I thought I was a gunner just now. Thanks for the help. And if you need any supplies, I have a few to sell. Oh, let's see what you got. Take a look. Okay. Wow. Dwarven metal ingot. 61 bucks. Sure. Iron ore? Always useful. Um, I mean, this guy just has like a bunch of crap. He's just got just a bunch of crap on him. But some of this stuff is hard to come by sometimes. He's got a whole bunch of ingredients and some lockpicks and stuff that I don't need. Okay. Would you like to buy from me, though? Since you have 174 gold. How about you consider buying from me something that I don't need? Such as... This scroll of dread zombie. How about that? That'll be useful for you. Mm-hmm. Nice. It's a deal, then. Okay, we have to head up here. We have to head up this way. We're on a great... We're on a grand adventure once again, guys. We're going to meet Mercer. We're going to go take down the person who's trying to take down the Thieves' Guild. And hopefully, with any luck, this will be our ticket to becoming the Guild Master. Mercer will be like, you know what? I'm too old for this shit. And then we'll get it. Hey, Sips. Here's your Skyrim themed stinker to celebrate the post dad deck stream. Oh, thanks, man. How do you address a letter to the Dragonborn? How? To Thuam, it may concern. <laughs> Hopefully, TTS didn't screw that up. No! Have a good stream, bud. It was keep fine. Keep playing games to have fun. And oh. I'll keep supporting your shiny air. Oh my god. I don't mean to alarm anyone, but. It looks like a. Oh. <laughs> A shit mother. 
has appeared out of nowhere here. Oh. Oh shit. Her exploding minions are coming. No problem. Oh yes! Right between her dead breasts. Who's this? Is this a shrine to RK? Okay. Shrine to RK. We don't recognize you as a god. There's only one god as far as we're concerned. That's Mr. T himself. All other shrines can quite frankly get fucked. That's why we steal the stuff from all the other shrines. They're bad shrines. We're only we're, we're only looking for good shrines here. Oh my lord. There's a dog here that killed a, a goat. Oh shit. Ouch. Oh, we're we're in Winterhold territory, aren't we? This is definitely up by where Winterhold is. It's very cold. It's it's like this outside where I live right now. This is exactly what it looks like. When I open my garage door. Imagine I'm in my garage now. I open my garage door. Oh, it's a cold one today. It's cold. Oh. Nailed that little pupper. Nailed him good. Nailed him from far away too. Nice. It's a cold one. Niadric, thanks so much for the bits and the joke, man. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. To thum it may concern. I get it. I get it. You have to use your thum. But what's a thum? You don't know what a thum is? What are you, some sort of penis? Are you some sort of penis out here in the wilderness? Doesn't even know what a thum is? Oh my god. Somebody left their dead horse here. Uh oh. Hold on. That's our contact. It's Mercer. Almost took him down. Mercer? You must be freezing your balls off here. What's up? Good. Finally here. How long have you well, been I've here? I've scouted the ruins, and I'm certain Carlia is still inside. Okay. You saw her? No, I found her horse. Don't worry, I've taken care of it. She won't be using it to escape. Let's get moving. I want to catch her inside while she's distracted. Take the lead. You want me to lead? I'm sorry. I was under the impression I was in charge. You're leading, and I'm following. Does that seem clear to you? Just make certain you keep your eyes open. Carlia is as sharp as a blade. The last thing I need is you blundering into a trap and warning her that we're here. All right, listen, guys. Okay? Prediction time. This Mercer guy is not a nice guy, okay? He never has been. Um, the game seems to go out of its way to make you dislike him. So I think he's going to try to double cross us down here, maybe with the help of Carlia, or maybe say to Carlia, let's work together again and take this guy out. And then I'm going to have to fight them both, potentially, take them both down, and then I'll become the leader of the Thieving Guild. I think that's what's going to happen here. That's my prediction anyway. How did Gallus die? Tell me about Carlia. Okay, we don't need any of this you stuff. You see Carlia, don't hesitate. Kill her. Okay, or maybe I'll just pickpocket you instead while you're not looking. What does he have on him? Let's see, there, is there anything here that maybe would signify some sort of betrayal? Do you think we can take his belted tunic off of him while he's here? We have a 50-50 chance. Hey. Yes, yes, what is it now? Did you just get suddenly a little bit colder or no? Not really. Okay. In we go, boys. In we go. I hope my prediction is, is right. 
I love predicting stuff and then being right. That's my favorite thing. Do you have the key? It's locked. Must you keep stopping? Do you have a key for this place? Because it's locked. Let's get going. I want her head on my mantle. Well, we can't get in. We can't actually get in unless you come down here and unlock it, maybe? Is that something you're able to do? Oh, here he comes. Okay. Look, it's locked. It's locked. He's got to have the key, right? They say that these ancient Nordic burial mounds are sometimes impenetrable. Hmm, this one doesn't look too difficult. Oh, yeah, he's going to open it. Here we go. Nice. Quite simple, really. know-how. A lot of skill. That should do it. You. Nice. Well done, Mercer. You done it. He actually did open it. Who's Rodahim into the door? Tempting. Tempting, but I'm glad we didn't do it. Okay, let's be... Let's harvest some barnacles, but let's be wary of traps down here as well. She might have a whole bunch of banded thugs. Ugh. Stench in here. This place smells of death. Be on your guard. Yeah, you know, there's gonna be a lot of druggers down here for sure. Okay, that one's dead, don't worry. That one's that one's long gone. Oh, there's a chest here though. Oh, a greater soul gem. Oh, shit. What kind of, kind of so moves is he fucking rocking? You got a life steel blade there or something? Holy shit. What is that? What the hell is that that he's got? That seems like really OP. Super OP. That seems super OP to me. Maybe it's not actually that OP. I missed. I missed again. Okay, got him that time. <laughs> Pull the chain over there and watch out for the spikes. Like Carlia reset all of the traps. What chain? I don't see. I don't see no chain. I don't see a chain anywhere. So wait, she came in here and she she killed all these things for us, for us to just loot and stuff. Seems pretty good. That one's dead. We just have to double check to make sure oh, all of them are dead. Oh, I see the chain now. Okay. For fuck's sake, Mercer. Fuck. Fuck me. Okay. That's the first, that's our first failure down here. Mercer is right now laughing his balls off at us. That. You can't hide from me. Haha, <laughs> I killed him before you could get him. There's a white. A Walter White. Okay, I'm gonna save. Save early, save often. That's what they say. I've played all the Sierra games, I know what's up. shot actually. Just missed the whole damn thing. Oh my god. So it begins. 
That one tried to run away. Oh shit. We got, we got company. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, baby! Okay, it's level up time. We got this. Uh, do we want more stamina? Yes. Faux show. Sure. Okay, let's see. Where are we up to with archery now? 67 requires 80. Hunter's discipline. I don't want that actually. That one does not appeal to me. Okay. What about, right, what about enchanting? New enchantments are 20% stronger. Seems pretty good. Okay, we'll do it. I think we'll grab a couple of points in enchanting since we are doing, actively doing some enchanting, right? We want to have better enchants. Our next, um... Two more of them ahead. Where? Oh, you're right. What was that? It was the uh, the two more that you're talking about. Mercer, you are dumb as fuck, right? Holy crap! <laughs> oh shit! That one's Fusro dying. Oops. Gonna have to shoot him right in the dick. Sit down. Oh, there's another one coming. You ready, Mercer? On guard. Whoops, Mercer, I accidentally hit Mercer. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mercer. I bet you wish you had your um your pajamas on underneath there now. It would have probably soaked up a little bit of the damage. Didn't have his he didn't have his jammies on for that one. Because I stole it. That's right. I did it. It was me. It was all me. These urns are kind of good sometimes, right? Like I had a silver ring in it. I would say that's a great success. Okay, where's the trap coming from this time? Watch out for like... This one's going to be a poison dart one, I bet. You're quite noisy for someone who claims to be a thief. What choice do I fucking have? I'm not the one who tripped over like 20 traps and ran into fire, Mercer. You big SOB. Oh look, these are unlockable. Ooh. Hang on, there was another one up there that wasn't there. Might have to go back. We might have to go back up, boys. There's another door up there. I think maybe we could have unlocked that one as well. All right, Eric and Mr. Pinchy. You guys didn't bother to come in? It's just me and stupid here? I'm sure. Well, this is going to go well, isn't it? When he backstabs me. Okay, let's go check out this other door. Or is this other door the uh, way out? Because it's very close to the entrance. We still have to check it just in case, though. What if there's like a... Fucking awesome super bow of... No, we can get in here. Okay. Alright, so what we're looking for is the fucking awesome super bow of... Oh my god. I didn't... Ultima Magica, though. That's pretty good. There's, a couple... There's an ancient Nord sword here. Here. Here, have this. Want this? Ugh. Here, take that. That's all that was here. Okay, come on. You're quite noisy for someone who out of my way. Thief. This guy's just sassing me out all the time. I think we are gonna have to kill him. Maybe we'll kill him and make it look like an accident. Maybe that's the thieves' guild way. Maybe that's how we do it. We kill him and make it look like an accident, and then we become. The Thieves Guild guys. Challenge. Fuck, nice. 
We made quick work of those guys. No problem. Got him. Three thieves. Three thieves. Thieves who adore you. Now go ahead now. This one. He's got a rocket in his pocket. And that's okay now. And this one. Says he wants to buy you a rocket. Oh, we've been in here. Oh, so this is the way to go. Okay, Mercer, sorry. I got a little bit lost. Only temporarily lost, though. All right. Be careful for traps. All good? All right. All clear. Let's go. God, it's nice not having Easy -E or Mr. Pinchy down here for a change. I'm glad that they stayed outside, the bastards. They're always in the way, and they're, oh, they're always making a lot of noise and shit as well. Uh-oh. Not able to see me. <laughs> I don't understand. What was that? A bunch of really dumb droggers. Oh shit. <laughs> the Mercer. My apology. Jesus. What is this? Rats coming out now, too. I'll spit on your oh, my God, it totally kills, kill stole that. Come on now. <laughs> I think he's just getting shot at now, as well. What's shooting you? Oh, it's this guy, of course. <laughs> Fuck. What a fucking pianist. Oh, that was a lot of druggers. That was a lot of dudes. We got them all, though. We got them all. Look at all of these nice new arrows that we're getting, to Scourge. Oh, what's this? A honed ancient Nord greatsword. That's 24 damage. Fuck, that's pretty good. Oh, look at this. How romantic. Look how they died together. In holy macaronis. Put the water on the macaronis. the water on the macaronis. This one is totally naked. Alright, we got this. I think we're doing pretty good. I stole his kill. Hell no. That's not my style. That is not my style. I'm the one who's doing all the killing down here, not him. Alright. I'm being very aware of traps here now as well. Let's look for switches for the traps. None seen so far. How are we doing? Oh. One of these. Ugh. Disgusting. Oh wow, look at there. Oh, how do we get down here actually? Wait, was that Must where we just were? Stopping. Yeah, look, there's a whole room down there filled with oil and some sort of... How do we get... Oh, I don't think we can get there from down there. We have to go this way. You're quite noisy for someone who claims to be a thief. I'm not making any noise at all! always was a nimble minx. Here's the sanctum. You're quite noisy for someone who claims to be a thief. Yeah. Oh, you're a big duty pants. Yeah, I think we're sneaking by some of these ones that would have otherwise come alive because we just got a sneak skill increase. Who's there? Oh, 
<laughs> right in the ass. Sorry, Mercer. Sorry about that again. Didn't mean to. You mean nothing! Okay. Oh. No. Oh my god. Shit. Oh, fuck. Where did he come from? Oh my lord. Down here, I think. I think Mercer's down. He's down for the count. Whoa! Mercer. Come on now. Potion of healing. Got it. Feeling fine. <laughs> oh my god. That was that was quite the fight. Actually, there was a lot of druggers down here. I think we tripped both of the traps and that's what woke them all up. Maybe we should have taken some of the ones upstairs out before we came down here. Fuck, these guys are tough. Jeez. Okay, we'll take a lot of this stuff, though. We'll take a lot of it. I mean, there's a lot of junk down here, too, though. Lots of junk. But it all adds up, right? All the money adds up. And before we know it, we'll be millionaires. This time next year, we're gonna be millionaires. Nice. Okay, let's do a quick save. And carry on through. We're on the right track. We should have been through here as well. How can you tell? Can you smell her or something? Is it a smell thing? Your feeble attempt to hide is insulting. Oh my god. Thought I was being attacked from behind there again, but I was not. Ew. Oh, look at that. He's all burnt up. What happened down here? What happened to that man to get him so burnt up? That door up ahead looks perfect for hiding an ambush. Be ready. Okay. some Iceland spells. Jesus. This is a Draugr Scourge Lord. This is gonna be the toughest fight we've ever had. Mercer, out of the way! Let me use my yell on him! Got him. Good tanking, Mercer. Great tanking. That was the last boss of the whole game, I think. He 
had an enchanted sword. That was great. Oh shit. That will be my triumph. Oh, very fancy. Very fancy. I could have done that myself, actually. I just wasn't really ready for him to appear like hope. Oh. Disarm. Wait. Which one was that? What? What did we get? It was disarm. Oh, I thought we had that already. I mean, disarm's pretty good, though. We might need to use it. Although, there's only one Thum for me, and that's the original Thum. Fusroda, the full one. I only use the full one these days. That's all I need. Oh yeah. An Orcish Warhammer. Scaled Helmet of Eminent Magicka. Kinda useless, but we'll take it anyway. We can maybe bust it down, or sell it. And or sell it. That would be good. Alright, Yelling Wall. We got a yelling wall. That's good. That's really good. Oh. Ice and chitin. Go back to bed. There. I made him go back to bed. After you. Or am I still leading this operation? Sure. By sneaking. Oh, fuck. My follower cannot accompany me here. Why is that exactly? Oh, I see. He's gonna do it. We didn't bring our claw. Ah, it's one of the infamous Nordic puzzle doors. How quaint. Without the matching claw, they're normally impossible to open. Since I'm certain Carlyle already did away with it, we're on our own. Fortunately, these doors have a weakness if you know how to exploit it. Quite simple, really. Wow, Mercer. Close, You're so smart. You're such a smart man. How do you do it time after time after time? He just, he backstabbed me. I knew it. He backstabbed me. Or are we both going to be apprehended now and I have to make a choice? That's also a possibility, right? I'll check out this cutscene. Do you honestly think your arrow will reach me before my blade finds your heart? Oh, he hasn't backstabbed me. To try. You're a clever girl, Carlia. Buying Golden Glow Estate and funding Haunting Room Meadery was inspired. To ensure an enemy's defeat, you must first undermine his allies. It was the first lesson Gallus taught us. You always were a quick study. Not quick enough. Otherwise, Gallus would still be alive. Gallus had his wealth and he had you. All he had to do was look the other way. Did you forget the oath we took as Nightingales? Did you expect him to simply ignore your men? Night wait, Nightingales? Enough of this mindless Mercer is a Nightingale? Come, Carlia. It's time for you and Gallus to become reunited. <gasps> oh, I see. Hang on a second. I'm no fool, Mercer. Crossing blades with you would be a death sentence. But I can promise the next time we meet, it will be your undoing. She disappeared. I can see her. I can take the shot. I'm just really incapacitated right now. Revive me. Give me CPR and I'll get her. How interesting. It appears Gallus's history has repeated itself. Carlia has provided me the means to be rid of you, and this ancient tomb becomes your final resting place. I knew it. I knew it. But you know what intrigues me the most? The fact that this was all possible because of you. 
Farewell. I'll be certain to give Brynjolf your regards. She's gonna stab him. She's gonna kill him. Uh-oh. Did he kill me? Am I actually dead? <gasps> no! I'm back! I'm alive! Where am I? Easy. Easy. Don't get up so quickly. What How happened? How are you feeling? Uh... You shot me! No. I saved your life. My arrow was tipped with a unique paralytic poison. It slowed your heart and kept you from bleeding out. Had I intended to kill you, we wouldn't be having this conversation. I don't want to be saved by an elf. My original intention was to use that arrow on Mercer, but I never had a clear shot. Oh, I see. I, I went in first. I made a second decision to get you out of the way that prevented your death. Watch out. Looks like my <laughs> Hey, guys. <laughs> Welcome back. Then I'm in your debt. Why sh Okay, fine. Then I'm in your debt. More than you'll ever realize. The poison on the arrow took me a year to perfect. I only had enough for a single shot. All I had hoped was to capture Mercer alive. Why? Mercer must be brought before the guild to answer for what he's done. He needs to pay for Gallus' murder. Son of a bitch. How will you prove it now? My purpose in using Snowvale Sanctum to ambush Mercer wasn't simply for irony's sake. Before both of you arrived, I recovered a journal from Gallus's remains. I suspect the information we need is written inside. So Mercer was doing the dirty. Well, what's it say? I wish I knew. The journal is written in some sort of language I've never seen before. Is it Argonian? Because... Enther. Gallus's friend at the College of Winterhold. Of course. The only outsider Gallus trusted with the knowledge of his Nightingale identity. I... There's that word again, Nightingale. Yeah, does that mean that Mercer was um, somebody who lived at my house and played the guitar for people? There were three of us. Myself, Gallus, oh, and Mercer. I see. We were an anonymous splinter of the Thieves' Guild in Riften. Perhaps I'll tell you more about it later. Right now, you need to head for Winterhold with the journal and get the translation. Okay. Here. Take these as well. They may prove useful for your journey. Thanks. <sighs> Can't you come with me? I'm afraid not. There are preparations to make, and Gallus's remains to lay to rest. I knew Mercer was was no good. Can. Okay, sure. Remember, speak only to Anthony. Trust no one else. All right, you know, you're very soft-spoken. Can you, like, just try to speak up a little bit? Very quiet. Okay, so Winterhold is just over yonder. We haven't been here yet in this playthrough, but we did all of the quests in Winterhold when we were Princess Leia. Do you remember all that? Good times, huh? Winterhold. Very snowy place. I don't know, Winterhold's not bad, though. No? What's going on with the, um... What's what's going on with the quality and stuff of the stream? Is everything good? Have we been dropping frames or anything? Oh shit, we dropped a, a couple of frames, actually. I might need to lower the bitrate just a tiny bit. Even though I have, like, good internet. It seems we've dropped a few frames. It might be something to do with, like, the weather and stuff, though. No? There have been a few frame drops. We may have to bump it down to like 5k or something. We might have to bump it down. We'll see though. It's peachy. Oh yeah, we'll get to see old Beardo when we're there as well, won't we? Good old Beardo. That was good. Usually happens around dusty or smoky areas? Okay. We're like we're we're using a, about six meg up to stream this right now. And I have ten meg. 
So if it if it fluctuates over, sometimes there'll be a drop. Flame elemental out here of all places. Does anyone know? <laughs> okay, one out of ten fire salts recovered <laughs> for Balamund. Good, good shit. Oh, somebody over here. Somebody's being attacked by what looks like a bunch of wolves. Who is that? A storm cloak? Somebody from Winterhold? Whoops. It's a fellow storm cloak. Don't worry, I got him. He's running away. We'll never let him get away. Ugh. Oh. Nice shot. Yeah, they're reforming the Dawn God. Vampire. <laughs> of course. No need to say thanks. Just tell me about the Dawn Guard. That's all I need to know about. There's no need for you to thank me at all for saving your life from attacking wolves. Huh? Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. <laughs> <laughs> right in the neck, baby. Oh. Looks like he had a... Oh my god. Oh my... Oh my... Oh my god! Come on! How did I miss every single one of those shots? That's crazy. Oh, check it out. Uh-oh. It's cold. My excuse is it's cold out. Oh my god. No. No. Oh! <laughs> it's like here. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, man. I have gold. I have gold. Okay, so I think we have to go kill Ice Wraiths down here at some point as well. But let's get to Winterhold first. Because we gotta do it anyway. And then at least we can just fast travel to there and get to this other place faster, right? Uh oh. Looks like we've got company. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, fuck's sake! Ah! No! Man, the goats of Winterhold are so hard to kill for some reason. Okay. Check this out. This is the one, boys. Oh, I give up. I fully give up. Oh, jeez. <laughs> the worst. Just the worst. Oh, watch out. There's a bear up there. Easy. Just be careful, okay? Oh, my. Lord. <laughs> Oh, look! He's done us a favor! Look at all of these filthy Imperials he killed! Oh, hang on. It looks like he killed one of our boys as well. <laughs> Eric! Perfect time! Eric! He wanted to trap his soul forever. What gives, baby? What gives? Oh my god. This hour is blown by, guys. Holy shit. Man, oh man. How far did I get with the Thieves Guild story? We're doing it right now. Um, we just got um, double-crossed by uh, Mercer and he tried to kill us. And then um, that, that woman helped us out. The elf woman. You know which one I'm talking about? So that's what we're doing. We're gonna go get this uh, journal translated. From this guy who is in here, apparently. So we can actually fast travel to Winterhold. No, which is pretty good. Just walk away from me. What do you think you're going? 
What's should happening here? For a drink, of course. Where else could I even go in this God's forsaken town? I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind, will you? Very funny. I'm sure you've <laughs> noticed that Winterhold isn't exactly overflowing with people. So I'll sell whatever I can. If it's worth putting a price on, you can bet I'll do it. I've been burned a few times, made a few bad deals, but mostly I come out on top. You said something about a bad deal? Yeah, it was stupid of me. <laughs> I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused the trade. But I didn't, and now I'm stuck with this worthless junk. What is it? Some line about this claw thing in Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back there. Yeah? Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber. I don't know. What was I thinking? I'll take it. Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient tomb filled with who knows what. Druggers. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold and then it's your problem. Sure. Fine, here you go. You get killed on account of this thing? It's not my fault. Got it? Actually, I'm writing on a but piece of paper right now. It's all burnt fault. But I suppose it does turn out to be worth something. Let me know, will you? Yeah, sure. Fuck. Hmm. You're dead. You're dead. It's worth a try. It's gonna be worth a goddamn fortune. Just you wait and see. I used to be an adventurer. Nice. Yes. The frozen heart. I'm sorry, could you trouble? If I die, arrest Berna. Absolutely. Trouble? Nothing of the kind, actually. What did you do? The mages don't let us go in the college. They said it's not safe in there. Yeah, it's true, it's not. Have you ever been, it's a shithole. Don't go in there. Just say the word if you need a drink or something to eat. I don't deal with any college applicants these days, so don't bother us. Hello. Can I help you with anything else? I've been sent by Carlia. Carlia? Then she's finally found it. What? Do you have Gallus's journal? How did you know? Yes, but there's a problem. A problem? Let me see it. Ah, oh, this is just like Gallus. A dear friend, but always too clever for his own good. He's written all of the text in the Falmer language. Oh. Can you translate it? No. However, I know someone who might. Come on. The court wizard of Markarth, Calselmo. Oh, they I know him. The materials you need to get this journal translated. Word of warning. Calselmo is a fierce guardian of his research. <sighs> Getting the information won't be easy. I hooked him up with a real babe, actually. So it's fine. Thanks, Enthia. Thanks for dragging me all the way mule. out here just for that. Speak to him. Okay. I know he's a stubborn mule. I've spoken to him many times. Hi. Everything's all right? Yeah, perfect. Thanks. Thanks for checking in on me. All right. To Markarth. To Understone Keep. Oh, thank God for fast travel, eh, boys? Imagine we were manually going everywhere. He does owe me. He owes us a lot of favors. You guys are right about that. Holy crap. I mean, we, we hooked him up with a real humdinger of a babe. You know what, though? Knowing this game, he's gonna forget all about it. He's gonna be fucking cagey as shit with me and stuff. He's not gonna give up the goods willingly. But maybe, you never know. If only burglars and vampires creep around off the dark. Which are you? Um, a bit of both. Sometimes almost a vampire. Just down to laziness, mostly. Look, I'm very busy, so this better be important. Excuse me. Then you were well informed. I am at this very moment on the cusp of completing my magnum opus on the subject. Wow. I'm calling it Calselmo's Guide to the Former Tongue. It will revolutionize the way we understand those ancient beings. Preposterous. That research represents years of personal toil in some of the most dangerous Dwemer ruins in Skyrim. I helped it's you! mad to think I'd allow anyone to see it before it's completed. Fine, maybe I'll just take that woman back then. Oh! Hey! Even after everything I did for you and Feline! Well, I'm not blind to the fact that you've been instrumental in wow. the affairs of the heart. If you wish, you may enter my Whoa. section. But I'm afraid the laboratories are still off limits. Okay. That's the best I can offer. I'll take it. I'll take it. 
Oh my god, this game. Oh, it remembered! That is fantastic. Holy crap, is that not fantastic, guys? We did a random fucking quest to help him, and it fucking- Oh my god! That blows my mind! My mind is totally blown right now! Fuck, that's so good! Ah, shit. We can get into the museum now! No problem! We can read his magnum opus! So, oh. have you stopped racially abusing all the elves yet? No. Jesus Christ, I'm be only, praised. I'm only just getting started, actually, Lemon. Thanks so much for the donation. This is fucking awesome. Hey guys, what's up? Nice museum, it's loud as shit. I've never been to such a loud museum. <laughs> Look, nice, I like that. Really good. Oh yeah, look, we got some books here. We got all sorts of shit in here. I think we have to get in for the I'm a sword man. That's nice. That, that's really nice. Good to know. Nice. He said the labs are off limits, but we're gonna go check it out anyway. Since you're using mods now, there's a mod that stops the AI from doing the bullshit CSP dodging. Kill any intruders on site. What? Okay. Got a lab journal here. Uncle Kalsmo got back from Mzinshalef today. Hey, thanks, um, Silent, for the uh, for the bits. There's a mod that stops the AI from doing the bullshit. ESP dodging. That's happened a lot, actually. Maybe I should get that. Lots of artifacts this trip. He even brought me something. A spider that didn't completely shatter when the guards smashed it. He wants me to get it working again. My first big research project. Spider Centurion Research, week one. I've reassembled the spider with spare parts from the museum. All the joints move, but not on their own. Uncle said the spider needed a control crystal with the right electroharmonic signature. The guards are now are out looking for one now. Spider Centurion Research, week two. After yesterday's incident, I assembled a staff to hold the crystal. It actually works. When you use the staff, it creates a beacon of some kind, and the spider just walks on over to it. Better yet, it doesn't, it doesn't attack everyone on site now. Week three. Apparently, it will still attack, just not on site. During this morning's experiment, one of the newer guards was startled and drew a sword, and he was dead before anyone could react. Did it actually detect hostile intent? Week four. Further testing confirms that the spider seems to detect the intent of its controller in some way. Last week, it tried to defend me from a threat. This week, I snapped at a guard who interrupted my latest test and it lashed out at him. Fascinating! Week 5. No one appreciates my work. Uncle Calcimo is buried in his Falmer research and doesn't have time to help me with the spider anymore. The guards are all afraid of it. I keep telling them it's harmless as long as I keep it under control, but there have been too many accidents. They just don't believe me. I wanted to show the Jarl, but I can't seem to get the spider to leave the lab. It looks like its control crystal only works up here. Maybe if I can retune the enchantment? Oh, reattune the enchantment. Okay, let's steal this. That seems like really good. Oh, there's a spider control rod here as well. No, no, not this way. Go get her. 
He's doing it! Stay hidden! Let the spider do all the work! It's fighting stuff! It's doing it! Oh! Hey, listen! It got it! I think it worked! Here it comes! <laughs> Go get him! No! Not this way! There, go get him. Oh my god, this is so bad. It doesn't work. Okay, we might we might end up having to just take this guy down the old-fashioned way. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Oh. Oh, we need that mod, I think. All right, Eric. Take him down. Oh. <laughs> Where did the spider go? You're out of your league. <laughs> you can't see me still. I believe in you, Eric. Oh, nice. Fucking really good. Alright. We're doing it, guys. Oh, it's barred from the other side. Oh, so what's this, a dungeon? You tell me this isn't a big dungeon. A dungeon where you can steal a bunch of... Dwemer stuff? Like, plate metal? This stuff is all worth something, right? All of these bits and pieces? Oh, look. This is the guy that he killed. got this, Eric. Oh, nice. Good. Oh, shit. No, I got him right in his shoulder. Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, you know what? This is going to be pretty good, actually. Killing some of these guards. Payback. For all of the injustice I had to suffer. What on earth was that? What was that? <laughs> this is just like some spikes. Oh, shit. Alright, hang on a second, Mr. Pinchy. Mr. Pinchy? It's time to be useful. I need you to carry a bunch of heavy scrap metal. Where is all this? Okay, a gyro. An empty wine bottle. Greater soul gems. Oh my god, I'm still carrying so much. What did I pick up that was large door plate metal? It only weighs two. What did I pick up that was so fucking heavy? Anyone? The spider control rod weighs ten. None of this stuff is actually that heavy. What the fuck happened? Solid dwarven metal. Where's that? Where's the solid dwarven metal? I don't see it anywhere. Is it? It's grayed out at the bottom. Why? Oh, 
Oh, fuck, yeah. So what, do we have to give it to um, Easy E instead? It just feels right somehow. No problem. How can I help? Can you carry these really big pieces of solid Dwemer metal? I think we're going to need them. Okay, and you know what? Carry some of this stuff as well, like this uh, Reverend Elven Greatsword. Oh, yeah, you can have this, actually. You can use this one instead. That'd be good. And take that, too. Oh, my God, Eric. You lead, I'll follow. You know, if that's how you want to roll, don't let me get in your way. That's fine. You can do that. Where I think where we need to go is, like, over here, though. Oh no, it's over here. Falmer. So hang on, where are we right now? We can get up here, but we can't. Oh shit, the spider's back. We have to get around this way, okay. Let's just leave that thing there. It's too spooky. What do we need the solid dwarven metal for again? Do you guys remember? I remember last time we played this. We needed some for something, but I can't remember what it is. <gasps> oh, here we go, baby. Any good stuff in here? Is this where he sleeps? Ew. I bet his bed stinks. Oh my god, check this out. He's got all these bookcases and stuff here too. What are all these books behind the display case? These have to be worth something, right? They wouldn't be back here otherwise. Oh look. It's the Dwarven Trilogy. The Trilogy of Dwarves. Who's Rota? But still some of his underpants. Why does he have a I think he does some role play as a barkeeper in here, probably with like one of those guards. The equip Skyrim's answer to Ra to Randy Bobandi. To Bobanders. Calcimo is the Jim Leahy of Skyrim as well. Just do a lot of costume role play together. Oh. Sure. I'll take the four gold. It's fine now. I'll take this wine as well. Oh shit, we get a honey nut treat for Francois as well. <laughs> when we go back home, we don't want to. Ugh. There's dog meat in there. That's disgusting. Yuck. Chug, 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 chug. Someone is here. Guess who it is? Oh my god, a guy who can't aim for sh Oh my god. It's Mr. Mr. Knowing. Okay, got him. Got her. Oh. Nice. Whoa. <laughs> got him. Oh, that was great. What a shot. Right in the face, baby. Can we go down here first and check it out? There's got to be something down here, right? Oh, yeah. We're heading the right way now, I think. It's like some poison gas or something. Feels right somehow. Having this new life is an adventure. It's what I was meant to do. Let's get going. Okay, stay there. Don't you dare move. 
I don't want to get blasted into smithereens. This is, this is the shortcut. It's got to be. Don't move. Stay there forever, Eric. We'll be back in a minute. Oh, man. This could, this could be the finest move that we've ever pulled off. Why did we do this, actually? Well, now we have to go back down and get him after. That's fine. We can do that. We're almost where we need to be, I think. Oh, shit. We got company. I don't know if Mr. me and Mr. Pinchy alone can take these bad boys out. It might be tough. It might be tough. We might need to use our brains. Might really have to concentrate and use our brains. Okay, where are we right now in room? Fuck it so far away. We have to go through here, apparently. Okay, Mr. Pitchy. <laughs> You're on your own. and fucking all sorts of shit down here is crazy. There's so many traps in here. Twin secret. Oh, enchanting. Nice. Okay, let's steal all these guys, this guy's books. So when he comes back and he wants to have a little read, tough shit, baby. You can't do it. I think that's the door that just gets us out of here. Fuck. Okay, we did it. We, we snuck through. I think Eric is stuck down there forever now. <laughs> what? Mr. Pitchy got in somehow. What about Eric though? He's stuck down there forever. Now we're in Calcimo's tower. Fuck, we're gonna have to fight Calcimo, aren't we? Bet she's gonna turn up and he's gonna be like, I told you! Don't you dare go in my laboratory! Now we're gonna have to fight! Mano e mano! Oh my lord. What is this labyrinth? How do I figure this out? Oh, hold up a second, though. I can use this, right? I don't have the items required to make a copy of the inscription. What? How do I duplicate the writing on his on his stone? Oh, maybe he's got some tools in here or something. Paper and chalk. Okay, there's some charcoal. You scared the crap out of me, Mr. Pinchy. On a roll of paper. That makes sense, right? Let's take a couple of rolls of paper, just in case. Let's steal his greater soul gem as well. He's got a greater soul gem in here. He's not going to be needing that ever again, I don't think, anyway. Oh, here we go. Some new books as well that we don't have yet. Investigate the runes of Arkengadsnes. Sure, we can do that. No problem. Let's just take some more charcoal just in case as well. Just in case we run out. We can take a rubbing of this. Do these things come to life and attack us? I don't remember ever fighting a big guy like that, but maybe. Oh, here we go. Chivarandium. Let's also steal his drinking glass as well. 
Okay, perfect. I think we got all the cool stuff in here, possibly. Alright, let's take a rubbing. Accidents oh. like this don't just happen. Someone is trying to sabotage my uncle's research. I... Oh, oh my god. Alright. If there is a thief, he won't leave this tower alive. But shouldn't we inform Master Calselmo? I'll deal with my uncle. Just go. Scour this place from top to bottom. Oh my god. Oh, he's just gonna sit there with a the guard as well. We might have to take these guys all out one by one. Okay. Hold on a second, boys. I might have a potion for this. Um, haggling, healing, light feet? That could work. Do I have, like, just, uh, one where I could just disappear entirely? Pickpocketing. Okay, light feet might help us. I'm saving after using the light feet potion as well. Oh, man. I can't believe... Oh, look, we got the key to Nashwanzel as well. Your head looks like it's floating above your sweatshirt, almost like you have transcended time and space. I have. That's my, tr that's my trick. We're out. We made it. Okay, we have to go get our boy Eric back, though. Gotta go get our baby boy back. Stuck down there forever. Oh, fuck me! <laughs> Holy shit! What was that? Oh, this thing, this thing blew up. Oh fuck! Oh god! <laughs> oh my god! That was so fucking loud. Okay, we have to save here because there's a guard patrolling around here. I think. We're gonna just chance it, though. Alright, this is where we came in. We made our big power play. All that time ago. Alright, Eric. Don't worry, I got you, baby. We're getting out of here. One way or another. He's down, like, on the other side of here, isn't he? Okay, let's just go back down this way. And then we'll find him. Get him. And then we can get get the hell out of here. We've got all the stuff that we need. We just have to go back and get it translated, and then bam. Eric, don't don't move a muscle. <laughs> Good job, Eric. Oh God. Look, oh, this guy died down here. I think. All right, Eric. It just feels right, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Great. Let's go. Hey, let's. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh, good job, everybody. Good job. We actually did something, maybe kind of properly for once. We didn't have to kill too many people. Where's the way out? It's not down here, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. Just follow the trail of corpses back to get out. Thanks for tweeting my wedding invitation the other day. You hey. made my night. Oh, thanks for making that, CRJJX. And Rowdy Dog, thanks for the donation as well. Thanks so much. Do I do I actually want this thing? I mean not really. I don't want it at all. There. Okay. Good. Now we just gotta act like nothing happened. No problem. Hey guys, what's up? I tried to get in there, but the door was locked, so...
pissed about all this, I think. Hey, yeah, I was just in the museum. I tried to go in there and it's all locked up, so I'm just gonna go home now. See you guys later. Peace. Have fun. I don't think they bought it. I think they bought it. I think it's fine, actually. Alright, so we're now free to make it back to Hey, pa, 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 pa. Dad. Heading to Canada in the summer and visiting Algonquin National Park. No way! Is that anywhere near where you studied? It's if in not Ontario, so for a weird question, okay, bye, a Dad. It's, um, Algonquin National Park is huge. <laughs> it's really big. I've been camping there a couple of times. It's a really nice place. I saw a bear there. I hid from a bear there one time. Hey, my dude. My life. Just got paid the big ones, so I figured I should pay some back to the real guy. Thank you for all your content. It's helped me in some dark times. Much love. All the best. Oh, thanks. Your boy, Panda. Red Panda. And John Bees, thanks very much for the donation as well. Okay. Now, it's... I understand Courier has been complaining about our customers again. Aha. It's our inn, and they cause okay. him no harm. He's in the cellar for some reason. Don't ask me why. Is this our new base of operations? Oh, I know why now. Hi, Back Carly. Day, and how was our friend Caselmo? We haven't much Was there something this else? Time. This should help translate Gallus's journal. I suppose it would be inappropriate of me to ask how you obtained this, so I simply won't. A rubbing, eh? Odd. I expected notes. It's quite the tale. I understand. Now, let me take a good look at this. Over here, please. Calcimo's rubbing removed. Nice. Nice. Hmm. This is intriguing, but highly disturbing. It appears that Gallus had suspicions about Mercer Frey's allegiance to the Guild for months. Gallus had begun to uncover what he calls an unduly lavish lifestyle replete with spending vast amounts of gold on personal pleasures. He strikes me as the type. Does the journal say where this wealth came from? Yes, Gallus seems certain that Mercer had been removing funds from the Guild's treasury without anyone's knowledge. What a prick. Anything else, Enther? Anything about the nightingales? Yes, here it is. The last few pages seem to describe the failure of the nightingales, although it doesn't go into great detail. Right. Gallus also Mr. Pinchy's log. Scuttle, scuttle. Today is the best day of my life. Scuttle. I met a new friend. Scuttle, scuttle. He is a mechanical true. spider. I, Scuttle. I will name him I Jeff. Like Scuttle. What is it? I hope we have That's many an adventure done. together. Scuttle, I'm Scuttle. Sorry, I can't say. All that matters is we deliver your translation to the guild immediately. Farewell, Antha. Words can't express. It's all right, Carlia. You don't have to say a word. <gasps> hmm? Hmm? Uh, hey, thanks, Mark. <laughs> I was trying to read, sorry. I was trying to read it. Listen, all I want is the truth to be revealed to the guild. They respected Carlia, and she deserves better. Do whatever I... you can, and I'd consider it a personal favor. I agree. Thank you, Anthea. If you ever manage to gain entry to the college, and you find trying to rid yourself of stolen goods becoming a burden, come visit me. No Glad problem. you're enjoying Skyrim again, Sips. Questionable Donation train. See what I can do. <laughs> Real Jack Thunder, thanks. Why did Gallus scribe his journal in Falmer? We know that. He didn't want anyone to be able to read it. What exactly is a Falmer? What can you tell me about Gallus? Okay. If you have further need of me, you can find me in the college. Okay, great. Never donated, but been watching your streams <laughs> for a while now, and I love your streams, so here is some money. Thanks, Blossom07. Thanks. Thanks very much. I appreciate it. I'm Is glad you're here. Else? No. I must hasten to Riften before Mercer can do any more damage to the guild. Gallus's journal mentioned the Twilight Sepulchre. I've come this far, so I see no harm in concealing it any longer. 
What is it? The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to Nocturnal. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their lives. Oh. Why does it require that type of protection? Everything that represents Nocturnal's influence is contained within the walls of the Sepulchre. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath with Nocturnal and defiled the very thing he swore to protect. Thieves and temples, it just doesn't add up. I felt up. the same way when Gallus first revealed these things to me. I think given time you'll understand what I mean. I understand better if less mystery was involved. As a nightingale, I've been sworn to secrecy regarding the sepulchre. I know the guild doesn't do much to foster faith, but I'm going to have to ask that you continue to trust me. Very well. I'll make for Riften and scout the situation. See if I can discover what Mercer's up to. When you're ready, meet me at the Ragged Flagon. Isn't Mercer going to see the us meantime, there? I wanted you to have this. It belonged to Gallus, but given the circumstances, I think he'd approve. I'll put it to good use. If the guild isn't willing to listen to what reason, was it? you might have to. Night Taking guild. me up on my offer, eh? Good. Oh, I'm not actually. What's this Nightingale Blade? Nightingale Blade. Absorb 10 points of health and 10 points of stamina per second from the target. Oh, this is what, so this is what Mercer was using. He had swords similar to this. Nice. I mean, they got to expect that I'm just going to steal a bunch of stuff from down here. I am a thief after all, right? Maybe not the wooden bowl, but we'll leave the wooden bowl for now. Cool. All right, so the next step in this one is the pursuit. We have to, I'm on my way back to Ragged Flagon to meet up with Carlia. Using the information obtained from Gallus' journal as proof, I hope to convince Brynjolf of Carlia's innocence and Mercer Frey's betrayal. I think we're getting somewhere with this now, right? All right, boys, I gotta go though. I'm, I'm already late. I think uh, my family are gonna be wondering if I'm dead. I've been out here literally all day. Um, I've enjoyed it though. I've really enjoyed it. So let me save my game. Um, let me just make sure that it's saved and that I can load it tomorrow when we play some more. Looks good. Okay, excellent. And, um, and, and that's me done for now. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow morning though. Uh, probably like around lunchtime. Uh, so if you only want to watch gameplay, I'm gonna, I'm heading off now. Um, uh, but I'll be back tomorrow, um, for more. Uh, so I hope you'll join me. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for donating. Thanks for subbing. Thanks for resubbing if you did. I appreciate it.